This is a comparison video of the North Star Honda 8000 generator. I purchased the generator because Northern Tool claims that it has a total harmonic distortion or THD of less than 5% and also for the Honda engine which has a very good reputation of course. Unfortunately the generator does not put out less than 5% and it caused a great deal of light flicker while running my house on the dimmer switches. On a normal switch it was mostly fine, but we have a, a mostly dimmer switches in our house and it, it caused light, fl light flicker everywhere. And was very, very loud due to the open frame. So Northern Tool does not accept return, so I had to sell the generator at a loss, uh, unfortunately. Uh, the THD measurements were about 6.8 and the lowest I was able to achieve was 5.9. I ended up purchasing a Gen Max 9000 off of Amazon. Uh, it's very similar power output, about 7600, I believe. Runs on gas. This is actually much, much quieter than the Honda due to the closed frame and the insulation that they put in there. This is running 4200 watts here for this example. When I was running the Honda, it was much less than that. It was about 1000 watts I was using for those measurements. This is the Gen Max running the house power again. You can see uh, no more light flicker and the generator is barely audible in the background. The THD measurements for the Gen Max were less than 2%. The website claims that it provides less than 3% and uh, I got much less than that even. So the highest THD uh, was 1.5, here it's 1.4, and then the lowest was 1.2. And this is compared to 5.9% THD on the Northern Tool North Star generator. Compared to my regular power companies, power, the Gen Max actually provides cleaner power. This is from my power company, which again has normal voltage, uh, and ended up with a THD of 2.1%, which is still great, uh, but uh, slightly more than the Gen Max even.